So I was watching all of the lovely Flip Through Fridays um, from this week, and I'm racking my brain. I'm like, you know, do I have anything that I can flip through that doesn't involve moving a whole bunch of stuff? Because a lot of my stuff is stored in boxes right now. And um, then I said, you know what? I'm going to start a new Junk Tilda book. So um, this is from... Uh, Coming. Oh, boy. I don't even know. Uh, 20... <laughs> I might have started it in 2020 uh, or 2021, and I just want to, uh, you know, quick disclaimer, a lot of the items in here I've received from people. If I receive something from you and I don't acknowledge it that it is from you, I am so very sorry. Know that I love and appreciate everything I am sent, but I just can't remember sometimes. So um, what I put in here is basically everything everything you could think of. I put art from others. I put um, packaging. I put junk mail. I put memory, you know, memorabilia pieces, anything. This is, this, I call her Junk Tilda because she, there's just too much of an array to talk about um, what it is. Uh, so in 2019, I got this note. So this was started in 2019. Uh, I've done lots of books like this before, but this is the first time I have named one. So this is the first Junk Tilda. Um, Let Life Surprise You. This is a postcard I received from Elisa. Uh, so it was started in 21. Look at that. I didn't even read that. A book of junk, colors, happy mail, and fun. Started on 321. So there you go. I'll do that with the next one too. Um, so I don't know how many pages of this are going to be blank. But I'm going to retire her, okay? New year, new junk. Um, I like to put a lot of my full page things that I don't really have anything for. I'll put it in something like this. Um, these, okay. this I have received in happy, I know I got this in happy mail. It is supposed to be a rub on, but it won't, um, it doesn't work. It doesn't rub on. So I just used it as something, you know, for gluing. And this must have been when I first got my gelato. So I played with those a little bit. Uh, bushes. <laughs> I, guess, I guess I was going to do something there. Um, not like I need to pull these apart now. I'm not going to do anything else in here. Look at that goat. That is so great. Um, a lot of things that I do in here too are my... I really like this whole thing. It's like just a bunch of junk and some little artsy things. Um, another thing I did in here were my one magazine challenge where I take um, a magazine and I make as many spreads out of just what I get or just what I pull from that magazine so um, this came in happy mail I have bits and pieces from my collaging this was um, packaging something for my yeah. my child okay. and I put a tab on it here that must have been socks or something because it yeah. says polyester I hate polyester socks. Ugh, I just hate them. Um, Elvis, you know. This is from packaging. This came in Happy Mail. This is a die cut, uh, cut out. That's what was left. Isn't that cool? So I just kept it. I don't know. It reminds me of like a bowl. I don't know. I kept it. Okay. I have a bunch of them actually that look like that. Um, Cadillac. I have a bunch of Cadillacs ads from the National Geographic so when my studio set up I might have to decorate like the door or something in Cadillacs and if you want to know why it's because my dad had a 1969 Cadillac Coupe de Ville this is from this is from Happy Mail um and he was so proud of that thing that was like his pride and joy so I've been saving Cadillac ads this was Happy Mail I yeah I think it's supposed to open no, I don't think. I don't know. I don't know what happened there. This came in Happy Mail. I'm going to say this was from Elisa because she loves the butterflies. Tonight, we taco. So this might be, um, no, this isn't one magazine. But napkin, this is napkin. Uh, all this is from magazines. All magazine stuff. Oh, this is from the um, uh, Dollar Tree has their fairy garden stuff. I like to decorate the cards. Speaking of which, I got a haul from 
Dollar Tree, so I'll make a little haul video this week that shows some of the goodies I've got, but let's just say it this way. Totally diorama licious. Okay. I got some stuff to make some dioramas. This was a um Valentine's Day card. I've you've seen me play with these before. This was for my daughter. Um, this is the ones that she handed out when she was in school. <laughs> so, you know, stickers. That I think is from the anthropology. Anthropology. Um, and the you know, the sticker book that everybody has been buying. Orchids. I love orchids. This was from Happy Mail. This is from Happy Mail right here. From Lala 2020. I don't put, I don't put, um, this was Happy Mail too. See, look at the whole envelope. I don't put ATCs in here. I keep my ATCs in a box. Because I like to keep cards together. Um, this is like a little, you know, like a little writing space. This is Happy Mail. This is from Happy Mail. This is from Happy Mail. Look at these. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I might, I might make some bookmarks or something. I have the bookmark die. So maybe we'll work on, ooh, look it. Maybe we'll work on some bookmarks in the days ahead. Um, more Happy Mail stuff. This came from a roll of plastic wrap. Now... This plastic wrap was purchased um, by my dad. I was, you know, it's when Walmart in my area had first, first come to, to town. Um, the closest Walmart before that was like 45 minutes away. So we didn't really shop there. We didn't really shop there when they opened this one. But my dad did buy this plastic wrap there. And this is old. I mean, great value. I just finished this roll like this year, I think, within the last year. So, yeah, it's in there. Uh, die cuts and things from Happy Mail. Um, this starts a spread of my One Magazine Challenge. So all of this came from One Magazine. I believe it was Garden and Gun. Uh, don't quote me on that. But I do have videos of my One Magazine challenges including some screwed up ones that I edited very poorly so you can go and enjoy enjoy that this was some amazing happy mail that I had received from Laura um, Jersey Laura for those of you who know her from a while ago and um, she sent my daughter some amazing amazing things that they still have and they still play with so yeah I kept the card and, and the stuff from that I love these little hearts. I, I fold them up sometimes out of card stocks. More Happy Mail goodies. Uh, did I glue this? I hope I didn't. I hope I didn't glue this in there. Come on. Oh, what did I do? I do the, the jute to the thing. So look, I ripped it a little. Oh, no. That's from a glue stick. Poor, poor glue. You know, that's what happens with glue sticks over time. They just, it just doesn't stay sticky anymore. Although, if you really slather it on, it does, apparently. Because I have a lot of stuff in here that was glue stick. And that's the only thing I've had come off. So, oh look at more bushes. I guess I really wanted to put those in there. That's from a scrapbook paper pad. Um, this is just pretty. I don't know. It's pretty. Okay, I like it. And uh, more magazine, one magazine. This I'm going to assume was HGTV. Um, these, this is really nice. I like that whole thing. Happy birthday from Joni. And she gave me some coins too in this nice. I love these little um, eyeball pins. And I never think to use them. And I have them. I just forget. Um, so this is some more Happy Mail stuff. I've got big tag with the note, Clara. So she must have been sending out some Happy Mails. And I got some nice big tags. And uh, this bag, I'm gonna assume, is also from her. Church uh, windows, I love stained glass. This is um, tissue paper, actually, like for gifts. I have some really pretty tissue paper. 
that's like really that I don't know what to do with except for this. Uh, more Happy Mail stuff. The whole telephone. Look at this. The bird is wearing the crown. Um, oh yes, I I had this hanging up. Um, I was part. This is from Jean Bing. Look at how cute that little guy is. I was part of a Secret Santa swap in Crafting Mamas. Like when they, this was like the first when I was new there. It's like the first time they'd ever done that. So. The woman that had gotten me was a woman from Canada, and she sent me a whole bunch of gorgeous ephemera. And at the time, I didn't make ephemera like this, so I found it really inspiring. So what I did was I took it and pinned it all to the curtain. I have two windows in front of me. So I pinned it all to that curtain, and I just looked at it all the time. So this is also, oh my goodness, this is also from her. And at the time, I was pregnant with my youngest, and she sent this to me, welcoming her into the world. So that's really pretty. And this is also, um, this is from Elisa. More butterflies, I love all the butterflies. She sent me some gorgeous napkins too. Um, this is from, that's also from that woman from Canada. Her name is Janine. And uh, I just cannot, and this is a note that I apparently can't open. Apparently this doesn't want to reveal itself to anybody. Um, but yeah, I think I did that swap. I, I think I was, I think it was a month before I had her. So, uh, Ray, yep, this is from Happy Ray. And I have it pinned right in here. I'm assume that she sent me some happy, no, this is also from Ginny. I remember all these things because I looked at them in front of me all the time, day in and day out. I love this card. I love that, it's beautiful. And this tag. You know, those dimensional stickers. They just add so much. Like, I love using them in card making, too. Ooh, a little card with a star in it. This was uh, junk from, uh, you know, collection, collecting of junk. Uh, Jersey Laura. She sends, she, we, she used to send, like, you know, pounds of Happy Meal. I get, like, boxes. Huge boxes. And then I'd have to find homes for all this stuff. I was like, Laura, I have to find homes for all this stuff you sent me. So... You know, oh, this is, is this actually come out? It wants to, it wants to come off of here. Let's see. Let's see, come on now. Oh, there's nothing on the back. But it's cool, that's like pattern paper. That's cool. So I'm gonna uh, pin this. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pin right onto these pages that aren't being used. Just pin them all together. Don't tell anyone. We're shortening the book. All right. A nice card, Jean Bing. Nice stamping inside. Um, oh, this is like origami pocket. I like that. I love that little old lady. So cute. So nice. I got some stuff from Happy Mail that I received. Die cuts. I've done die cu cut swaps with a lot of people. Um, another one of those Dollar Tree tags, tickets, backings, whatever it is. Another thing from Janine. And this is Happy Mail. I glued some, I glued the Happy Mail to the Happy Mail. So that was from Mary Lou, I think, is what it's, I think if I can put the pieces together. Another one magazine challenge. This comes from the uh, Garden and Gun, I think. Uh, another one of my Dollar Tree cards, napkin, die cut, magazine. This is a, like a tissue paper. Some beautiful things. This is a lot of stuff, you know, happy mail, happy mail. So I put a lot of I put a lot of the things that I get from people. Uh, oh, that's just that's it. I thought it might have folded over. It's another little note, a little heart, painting paper scrap. It's another one of those Valentine's Day cards. Love it. I gotta find some cute ones for this year. Another one of those cards, some more happy mail. From Mel Joy, yes, Mel Joy sent me a beautiful envelope of goodies. A secret message, oh, it's a scratch off. Uh, an envelope of goodies, and I loved everything in it. Because if I don't put my Happy Mail stuff in here, I use it elsewhere. I'll use it in one of my themed journals or one of my other projects, like my napkin journal. I, I do get to it. So, yeah, this is um, magazine, one magazine challenge. I can tell because if it's just all magazine stuff, like, and it fills the whole page, that's how I know. Um, this comes from a Barbie uh, packaging that we didn't get. Um, it was a paper in a book. 
Oh, this is Happy Mail. This is from Mary, um, Mary Kay. I'm sorry. I think I said Mary Lou before. It's Mary Kay. And this was like the toilet paper crisis. So look at all the sending this thing and gorgeous card. Yes, it's from Mary Kay. I'm sorry. I get mixed up with the Marys. And um, more. Those are just random magazine images. Nice vase. I'm sorry, vase. A nice planter. Light pages. Uh, tunnel. I love tunnels and doors and windows. I just love that kind of stuff. This is washi tape that I made from a painting paper that I made. So that's, you know, sometimes like a painting paper, the whole thing goes just right. That's this. This whole paper went just swimmingly. So that's why it's, I turned it into washi tape. Hearts. Nice big hearts. Um, so that's just another magazine image. And tissue. This is some tissue paper. Uh magazine I believe that came in happy mail these were little beaded gem things from Dollar Tree I just you know added them here and there where I thought of it and this I don't think I have anything else nope so that's it so we're gonna I'm gonna make another one of these um, at my Dollar Tree haul I did get a few composition books with like gorgeous covers but I can't I feel like I can't use that for this this is something I gotta have a cover that I can put stuff on so yeah I didn't really get to decorate this cover because I was kind of just desperate to just get the glue in there but the next one we'll decorate and we'll we'll get the cover we'll do the cover together so we'll we'll get going on that but thank you for hanging out and I will see you soon over the next few weeks with another flip through Friday and I have the hashtag in my title and in my description, if you click on the hashtag lit up in blue or you type in hashtag flip through Friday, you will see a ton of amazing artists. I love going through all the flip through Fridays. Um, I try and like not do it every week so that I can, you know, get a couple of weeks in a row, but it's so hard because the flip throughs are so inspiring and actually watching them is what inspired me to get this one out and inspired me to start my next one. So yeah, flip through Fridays. Look at the um, look at the hashtag because you are just going to be blown away by how great some of these things are. But I love you all, and I am going to take off and make something for dinner. And like I said, we'll work on our next junk tilde. The second, um, we will work on her. Coming up, I will make junk. Junk Tilda. I will make a uh, a new one, and we'll we'll do the cover up nice because I got some composition books to use, so we'll do that. But ta ta for now.